Happy Martin Luther King birthday, everybody. This man was born in Georgia, January 15, 1929, Atlanta, Georgia. This man has stand up. He stand for everybody. He stand up for the black community. He has marched to. He he has marched in Washington D.C. to have in segregation set into place. Not segregation. In segregation. So blacks, whites, Latinos, Chinese, Arabic, and every other minority can come together like a closed fist instead of an open hand. He has done a lot, did a lot for the black community. He's did a lot for other communities. He never turned a blind eye. He, he never, I mean, he never stopped helping people. When he knows not to throw a fist, he stood his ground. Dr. Martin Luther King marched so every black, white, and other minorities could come together. If it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have a biracial president. If it wouldn't be him, black folks would still have to enter buildings through the back door. If it wasn't him, black folks would have to walk on the walk in the streets my white folks got to walk on sidewalks this man has did a lot he stood up for what's right he never hit nobody he always kept it real he always kept his word and everybody loved him for that because he had what we wanted was somebody to speak up and stand for something. Even though he didn't fight, throw a hit, he fight in a different way. Protest. He protests. He fought the good fight for everybody. I'm glad that he did. And I'm glad that he he did what he did. And I'm glad they made his birthday a national holiday. So kids will know that this man died to bring us together as one. Trying to tell America and trying to tell the world it's better to get along than fight a war. It's better to have hate no, it's better to have love than hate. Instead of hating your neighbor, you should love thy neighbor. He preached that good word. He taught us a lesson. And people didn't understand him. People may knock him down. Because he stood up for what's right. He's been called nigger. He's been called spoot. He's been called everything under the sun but he still stood his ground not saying a word about white people and the most famous speech he had was I had a dream if it wasn't for his dream nobody would never understand him he has helped so he had helped Rosa Parks when she sat in front of the bus and he stood for so much man and I'm glad that this brother did what he did God bless you Dr. Martin Luther King and next month is Black History Month and I hope y'all brush up on your history Black folks made a lot of things in life. And I hope y'all understand this, man. I'm not even out the white folks, but if it wasn't for him, 
and some white folks, some celebrities have some white celebrities have stepped in and supported him. Y'all would never understood. Y'all like what white celebrity stepped in? What some white celebrity stepped in? Yeah. Back in the late forties. Now back when he was marching, he had white celebrities, white people marching along with him. Even though the KKK wanted him dead. This man made history. This man had the President of the United States sign the Declaration Proclamation to get black kids into an all-white school. Like I guess if it wasn't for him, Obama wouldn't be in the White House. If it wasn't, being, if it wasn't for him, there wouldn't be no black police officers, black firemen, black scientists, black doctors. If it wasn't for him, black doctors wouldn't have white patients. White doctors wouldn't have black patients. If it wasn't for him, black folks would still be sitting there wondering what's going on. Still be sitting there looking like outcasts. Now, now, I sat here and I look and I love my black history. I love knowing what my other half did. My ancestors, people, black folks that did in the 70s and 60s and 50s and 40s and 30s because I love learning about what they all about. If you're going to hate on him, Dr. Martin Luther King, for what he stood for, then you is no better than the next person in line. Because he didn't hate nobody. He just hated their actions. He took a page out of Mahatma Gandhi's book and took a stand like he did. He said the best lesson he learned was from Mahatma Gandhi when he learned it's better to protest than raise a fist and raise a hand to somebody it's better to stand for what you what you stand for and I'm glad that this man did what he did to bring us all together I got white family and I got black family I got white friends and I got black friends this man did what he did because he knew it was right to do. Thank you Dr. Martin Luther King for doing your thing and y'all should be thanking this man on a daily basis because he did what he did. God bless America. Happy birthday Martin Luther King. If you got something negative to say Take it somewhere else. If you got something positive to say, write it in the comment or do a video response. That's what I like. A good positive comment or video response. This is Afro Joe. Peace out.